Oh, sorry, it's you. Thought well, you might need a friendly ear. Mm -hmm. I'm fine. Just overreacted, that's all. No, you didn't. He was out of order. Well, maybe I did egg him on. <laughs> Why are you blaming yourself? I don't know. Want to talk about it? Charles, I wouldn't know where to start. The beginning's always good. <laughs> and I'm a pretty good listener. Take your time. I'm lonely. Okay. Ever since me and Paddy have split up, I felt lost, helpless. It's like he's left this massive great hole in my life and I just can't fill it. You get used to having someone around, don't you, and when they're not. It's hard. Hmm. Try telling my son that. <laughs> yeah. He seems pretty angry. Even so, you really shouldn't allow him to talk to you the way he did yesterday. It's complicated, Charles. You deserve his respect. And he deserved a good mum, but all he got was me. I don't suppose you fancy a brandy, do you? Um... It's a bit early for me. Be uh, proud of Why not? <laughs> so I told all my mates I had this big house. The whole time it was a two up, two down with a lavvy in the backyard. <laughs> mm. What's happened? If you bothered answering your phone, you'd know. I must have left it in the bar. Well, your daughter's not feeling very well. The nursery had been trying to get hold of you, so in the end they phoned Paddy, who then phoned me. I'm so sorry. Eve, why don't you go upstairs and play? Your mum will come up in a bit, yeah? You know what? You don't deserve to be a mother. Now, hang on a minute. This has got nothing to do with you. She so just keep your trap shut. And then again, should have known there'd be a man involved. Oh, it's not like that. It's always like that. Especially when there's brandy out. Look, why don't you sit down and we can talk about this? Why would I want to be lectured by you? I'm trying to help. Yeah, well, don't bother. Just get stuffed, you preach you get. OK. I'm going to say this politely. Go home. Have a think about your behaviour. <laughs> wow. She's managed to reel you in, hasn't she, Vicar? Stop it! Why? It's the truth. Looks like your missus might have something to worry about. Watch your mouth. Or what? A plague of locusts are going to descend on me. Why are you being like this? Because it's happening again, isn't it? Only this time you're neglecting your daughter or for some bloke. You've got this wrong. I know what you're up to. I can smell it on you. Just try and remember your daughter's upstairs, yeah? No, he's not getting away with that. No, Charles, don't. Oi, a word! Apologise to your mother, I mean it. You for real? You disrespected her? Yeah. Well, maybe she deserved it. Because between me and you, she's a little bit of a slapper. I just thought I'd let you know that. Can we stop this, please? Why? Give me your boyfriend here a bit of friendly advice. Let him know what he's getting into. Call yourself a man? Well, last time I checked, yeah, I was, yeah. She's your mother! I know. It's bad luck, isn't it? Uh, just don't rise to it. How can you talk about her with such total disregard? It's pretty easy, in her case. And to be fair, she got off pretty lightly. No! <laughs> get... <laughs> Lunatic, what are you doing? Charles, please don't! Just stop it! Get... Uh, go on, get out. Pathetic. Whew. That was fun, wasn't it? 